Welcome back to the channel Pretty Little Things. I'm Akshati. And I'm Shorya. And Shorya, what are we doing today? So we just posted our Singapore vlog and so many of you requested us to show you what all we got. So we're finally doing the Singapore haul video for you guys and let's see what all we got. So last time we did a haul video for me and this time I went to Singapore really quickly. Like last time I went and then I came back for a week and then I went to Singapore again. So I didn't really shop too much. I mostly bought gifts for Praline because it was his birthday. But Shorya shopped and she shopped a lot. So there are a lot of things that we have to shop. So on the first day of our trip, we went to Boogie Street and I did not pick up a lot of stuff from there. Uh, I think she also picked up just two outfits. So the first thing that I picked up was this t-shirts or dress which I think you guys have already seen on our Instagram and what did you pick? I picked up this really cute pink sweater shrug sort of a thing from there. I love the colour. She picked up a lot of shrugs. Yeah, so this time basically I was not looking forward to shopping a lot but I wanted to pick up just the basics so a lot of plain t-shirts or shrugs or plain t-shirt dresses that's all I wanted to buy from there this time. So I picked up plain white t-shirt and I really like this. It's an off-shoulder dress. <laughs> what else did you get from there? Nothing. I just picked up this. Oh, this time, like last time when we went to Boogie Street, I found a lot of things. But this time, every store had like the same collection. There was nothing new that I could see. So they had a lot of off-shoulders and they had a lot of stripes. Stripes and checks. That's about it. And then on the next day, we went to Orchard Road and there like big nice showrooms there. So we went to a couple of stores and we picked up some stuff. What did you get from there? So the first store that we went was, I think, Temp. Yeah. And if you have seen the haul, then you would remember this dress. This is the first thing that I picked up from there. This is a very cute floral dress, which I really liked. And then I just picked up this pretty blue crop top. It was kind of different, so I don't know. I really liked it. I picked this up. What did you get? I just picked up two really nice long shrugs from there. They're very transy, very light. So I like wearing shrugs just to, you know, cover my sleeves or when I want something really long when I'm wearing very short shorts. So this, when I'm wearing, I don't feel like I'm wearing something because it's very light. And yeah, it's just like a cover up. So both of these I got. So next we went to Forever 21 and I picked up this t-shirt dress from there. I really liked the colour and it looked really pretty. Probably it's looking a little plain but it was looking really nice when you wear it. And what did you get? I think you get, got the black thing. Yeah, I got a similar t-shirt dress in black, plain black. It's very comfortable. You must have seen it in the video but now it's in the laundry. <laughs> Where did we go after that? Was it H&M or was it Cotton On? I think it was H&M. Okay, cool. So from H&M we both picked up this shrug. It's a very... We both fell in love with it the moment we saw it. It's a plain grey shrug but it's really pretty, it looks really nice and very comfortable, very soft. What else did you pick up? And I just picked up a plain mustard coloured crop top. Uh, I think you've seen it in the vlog as well. We wore everything that we bought from there. <laughs> yeah, so this is that. And what else? I bought two t-shirt dresses from there. Plain and long, very comfortable to wear these with sneakers and just take a sling. This one and I really like this color. Yeah, it's really nice. This one. That's it. Then we went to Cotton On and I picked up two things. I picked up a white pair of shorts, regular white shorts and another crop top, also very casual. That's it. While we were shopping in H&M, the H&M in Orchard Road is like really huge. It's a two-story building and we went on the top. There was something happening there and we were very fortunate to be there at that moment because H&M just started the beauty department and they had all of their beauty and cosmetics right there and they had just launched it and it's not there anywhere else. So we were very fortunate to pick up some products from there. Yeah, we couldn't pick up a lot of things because it was so crowded. Everybody was just everywhere. So we picked up this golden nail paint. We both picked it up and I picked up this white one as well and then we picked up this eye contour uh, silver eyeshadow. I'll show you what it looks like. Yeah. 
then we went to Victoria's Secret. So if you remember Akriti's uh, Singapore haul, I fell in love with the two things that she bought. So I picked up the same um, body lotion. This is the pink warm and cozy body lotion. And I'm in love with it. I cannot tell you how much I love this. So uh, I picked up the entire range. I picked up the scrub, the same warm and cozy scrub and the same warm and cozy body mist. And then I also picked up a hand cream. This is a Chotusa hand cream which can fit in your bag. This is a perfect condition hand cream. We also went to this store called a Dollar Store which is in Plaza Singapore on Orchard Road. The best part about this place is that everything is for $2. No matter what you pick up, everything is for $2. What did you get from there? Candles! Yay! I picked up this very pretty strawberry flavored candle and I I really could not understand how is it for two dollars because had I picked this up in India it would have been at least for like two three yeah. hundred it smells amazing it smells exactly like strawberries oh my god candle I picked up a lot of stationery it's got this pom pom sort of tie up things with it and these are like little pouches plastic pouches and you tie up with this so i got another similar thing these are again a couple of floral pouches i don't know how i'm going to use them but i really like them <laughs> everything is for two dollars there and then i picked up this cute thing thing with a brush inside so i'm gonna travel with this everywhere and the brush is very tiny and pink i think it's for babies or it's, something it's those are yeah, I think it's for me. I just wanted the cover, sir. <laughs> also, I know we shouldn't be trying out like really cheap cosmetic products, but we thought of picking up one one thing and trying because they say the Japanese products are supposed to be really nice. So I picked up nose highlight powder. So I still have to try this out. She also picked up something which she forgot to get. It was yeah. a blush. Yeah, I picked up a cream blush with a very fancy packaging, but yeah, I I couldn't get it. Sorry. So I forgot to show you one thing that I picked up from Boogies. It is this tissue box. It's a very pretty pink tissue box. This is how it looks like. So my concealer just got over. I was using the one from Bare Minerals and then I wanted something new. So Perry and Shorty made me pick up this Maybelline New York Age Rewind. Why is this Age Rewind? <laughs> It's just a highlighting concealer that you picked out for her. She want to try it. It's very comfortable to apply actually. It's Even very easy to apply. Yeah, it's very easy to apply. This is what the top looks like. So you just dab it on your face and use it. And I use it as a concealer because it gives like, it brightens up this area and it gives a nice highlight on my nose. So nothing to do with age rewind though. So Singapore had these really amazing stationery shops and then these cute little stores with amazing stuff inside and I just couldn't resist and I picked up this really cool thing. What does it say? It says I don't get drunk, I get awesome. <laughs> I have no clue how she's gonna use it but you're gonna have coffee in it. Yeah, I'm gonna have like strong shots of coffee. I don't know how to use it otherwise but I just want to keep it in my room, it's pretty! So then we went to Bath & Body Works and I picked up one entire range. So this is a pink chiffon range. It's a very fruity fragrance, the ones that I like. So this is a pink chiffon body wash, this is how it looks like. Then I picked up the same body mist and then I picked up the same body lotion. So these are the things. Then while we were roaming around in the mall, I spotted Urban Decay and I really wanted to try their lipsticks. I am in love with the packaging. It looks really nice and this was in the shade Checkmate. It's a matte lipstick and this is how it looks like. It's a very pretty shade. And then we went to Sephora and we spent I don't know how many hours there. <laughs> I was there covering everything on the blog while Shara picked up her favourite products. What did you get? I did not buy a lot, it's just two things. Uh, so one was the Born This Way Too Faced foundation. I cannot tell you how much I've heard people talking about this foundation, about how nice it is and it actually is. So I finally picked this up. This is how it looks like. Look at the bottom. It looks so pretty. And the next thing that I picked up was from Tarte. This is the Tarte concealer. It's a little small but it really works well. I tried it there and I fell in love with it. This is how it looks like. It's like a pen thing. So while shopping, we came across this really cute store with a lot of phone cases there and I picked up this piggy phone case. <laughs> Look at this, it's so cute. I don't know why, but it says 
Mm, bacon. <laughs> <laughs> You're a pig. But it's really cute. Then we went to this place called Mustafa. It is open all night. And basically, Mustafa is a place where you can find electronics and perfumes and all sorts of things at a very cheap price. Last time after we picked up a lot of electronics and perfumes from there and this time I picked up two perfumes, three actually. And what did you pick up? I picked up gifts from Berlin and I got him a perfume and I got him PS4 because he's always gonna stay a kid. <laughs> So, uh, one small perfume that I picked up was for my dad because it was his birthday. Then I picked up this Juvenshire perfume which I was eyeing on since I don't know when. So, this is how the perfume looks like. Then while we were searching for other perfumes, after they spotted this. I smelled it. It was actually my kind of fragrance. So, if you're wondering the kind of fragrance that I picked up, everything is sweet and fruity. And this was exactly the same. I'm pretty sure you've seen the bottle already. Also, I picked up a similar suitcase like Arkady's. Uh, it's just black and bigger. <laughs> it's too big. Yeah, it's, we both can fit into it. I swear, I think you, me and someone else can also fit into it. It's that huge. So yeah, I picked up that in black. And I also picked up this cute little thing. It's so oh, cute. Look at this thing, man. I am in love with him. You can just hug him and sleep. I swear it's so <laughs> soft and it's so suggest so a name though. I don't have I haven't kept a name. Goofy. No. But he looks like a goofy. No. He's so goofy. Put kar rakh de iska na. Na, fir to apni bottle mein dal lena. Jo wo cold coffee wali bottle hai. <laughs> so then we spent the next two days shooting and at Universal Studios so we didn't shop a lot. We went to the airport and picked up Let's show you. You show them what you got. So, uh, since it was Parikin's birthday, I did not want to just throw the gift at him. What I wanted to do was pick up a really cute small teddy and tell him that this is your present. Then I gave him the perfume and then I gave him the main present. So, this is what I got. Of course, it's gonna stay with me now. It's really cute, tiny teddy. The funniest part about this is that this came from a baby store, so it's for little babies. Yeah. <laughs> Then we went to Charles and Keith and I bought this bag. It's a very pretty, just a plain black bag with a sling to it and it looks really smart. Akati helped me pick this up and I'm in love with it. Yeah, the thing about Charles and Keith in Singapore is that it's Singapore's brand. So you get Charles and Keith really reasonable there. So if you plan to go to Singapore, please do pick up a bag from there for sure. Uh, you also got a bag last time. You forgot to show it to them. Yeah, out of all the pink stuff I was showing you in my haul video, I forgot to show one of the pink things which I got from the airport. The main thing. Yeah, and it's my Michael Kors sling. I have a lot of black bags and other colors, but I do not have like a nice light pink color. So I picked this one up. And yeah, this is my bag. <laughs> In the end, at the airport, after buying all of these things, we were only left with chillers. And then we went chiller shopping. <laughs> we picked up chocolates and uh, mints and all of that. The chocolates are over. We have mints left. One, one, one packet is in our cars and one is in our bags. So yeah, we picked up a lot of mints from there. So I'm just left with 10 cents now. <laughs> I don't think I'm left with anything. So this is about it. If you guys haven't watched our Singapore vlog, then I'm gonna link it below. And make sure you watch it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you want to know anything, then please leave a comment down below. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe to Pretty Little Things.